Andrew's students boarded buses to head out to area elementary schools for Read Across the District. It's Read Across the District Day, which means for 30 minutes today, the entire school, the entire district, everybody at every El Paso District School is going to be reading from 10 o'clock to 10.30. I'm here at Newman Elementary at, for Read Across the District, and I'm here re reading to little kids. We're giving back to the community and showing that there's other people here for the younger kids to inspire them. How goes the work, called the farmer. The duck answered, quack. We had a read across the district. I'm super excited because we have Stephanie Valle here. We have a local author, Mr. Philip Cortez, here as well. It's been such an exciting event, and I'm just really happy that I was able to, um, to host it here at Park, and I I really encourage people from the community to get involved. Brad is fun. Thank you for reading to us. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I like Brad and I can't wait to next year. Welcome to Rad. We're having the kickoff here at Guillen, uh, reading across the district. As you know, this is the, s the second year that we're doing it. Everyone is coming together to celebrate reading. We were lucky enough to be able to host the kickoff. You might be asking yourself then if reading aloud to our students is important and the answer is let's hear a resounding yes. Yes! Everybody's a buzz here and all throughout the district. We're really bringing in the community to interact with our students in a very special way and that is with books and stories and really getting back into the literature. <laughs> I, I wanted to say that, that RAD really is as, as successful as, as the people implementing it. And as people take on the challenge and as people take on the positive energy that RAD has, we can all say collectively, we are EPISD, because definitely I am EPISD.